For decades, the story of human origins has been largely centered on Africa. The prevailing narrative suggests that our early ancestors evolved on the African continent before spreading across the globe. However, recent findings indicate that this story may not be entirely complete. What if the roots of our lineage extend to a place we hadn't fully considered? A newly discovered fossil in Turkey could completely rewrite our understanding of where we come from. Deep within the hills of northern Turkey near the town of Çankırı, scientists have uncovered the fossil remains of a previously unknown ape. They found the cranium of a creature entirely unknown before. After studying it, they have dated the fossil and estimated that this species lived around 8.7 million years ago. It has been named Anadiluvius turkey, and it's no ordinary ape. Anadiluvius is a hominin, a group that includes not only humans, but also our direct ancestors, and the great apes, gorillas, chimpanzees, orangutans, and bonobos. The partial cranium is incredibly well-preserved, which has allowed researchers to study the face and brain structure of this ancient primate. The analysis of its features revealed that the creature weighed between 50 and 60 kilograms, which is similar in size to a large male chimpanzee. This is a significant find, not just for its completeness, but also for what it suggests about the very origins of the hominin lineage. The current prevailing theory suggests that the hominin lineage originated in Africa. However, Anadiluvius lends considerable weight to the hypothesis that this evolutionary branch may have first emerged in Europe before migrating to Africa. To be clear, primate fossils have been found across the globe. The world's oldest known true primate, the tiny shrew-like Purgatorius, lived in North America 65 million years ago. Early European primates, such as Tailhardina belgica, which is 56 million years old, predate African primate fossils like Algeropithecus, which dates to about 50 million years ago. All of these discoveries suggest that primates were not exclusive to Africa. This new understanding shifts our thinking from a purely African origin to one in which early hominines possibly evolved in Europe for over 5 million years before dispersing to the eastern Mediterranean. The evidence suggests that Anadiluvius and its relatives inhabited dry forests and spent much of their time on the forest floor. Other fossil apes discovered in Greece and Bulgaria, Uranopithecus and Grecopithecus, respectively, share close anatomical and ecological similarities with Anadiluvius. These finds support a new view of ape migration. It is believed that these apes evolved from ancestors in Western and Central Europe before radiating out to the Balkans and Eastern Mediterranean. These findings stand in contrast to the long-held view that our ancestors were first confined solely to Africa. This means that Anadiluvius and its kin could be crucial ancestors in our evolutionary story. While early hominine fossils are abundant in Europe and Anatolia, they are curiously absent from Africa until the emergence of the first hominins around 7 million years ago. This could suggest that our branch of the family tree had origins elsewhere, marking a dramatic and controversial shift in our understanding of human evolution. To be clear, this isn't definitive. More fossils, particularly from the crucial 8 to 7 million year window, are needed from both Europe and Africa to confirm the relationship between these two groups. As more fossils are unearthed and studied, we may uncover even more surprises about where we come from and how we became the species we are today. This is just the beginning of a new chapter in human history. We'll be keeping a close eye on further research and bringing you updates as they unfold. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel for more mind-blowing science content, and share your thoughts and questions in the comments below. What do you think about this new find? Do you agree with the hypothesis? Let's discuss.